What's up, Bender fam? Brandon here with Trailbenders Overland. And as you probably already know, we built this behemoth super custom truck over the last year during COVID. And one of the things that we knew we wanted to do different was put solar panels on top of the tent. And we have the Alphas and the Alpha 2s and every other tent that uh, Tough, Stuff, Tough Stuff manufactures. Uh, but none of those are really that conducive for putting solar panels on the top. So we reached out to Tough Stuff and they said, well, we're coming out with a new tent called Stealth and we'll ship you the first one we get and you guys can test it out and see what you think. So we've got a couple of nights sleeping on it. It's been installed, you've probably already seen it if you've watched any of the Deuce episodes, but this is a little walkthrough, quick walkthrough of the differences between the Alpha and the Stealth. So let's go take a look. Now that we've looked at the exterior, which is the major difference between the Alpha and the stealth version. The lid stays open nicely with even the two solar panels on top. I don't know what the rate rating is for the top of the tent, but I assume you could put paddle boards, surfboards, maybe a light kayak. Certainly we have the two panels up here and have been using it a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and open it up and uh, show you what it looks like when it's completely up. As you can see, it's got the classical ladder, same as on the Alpha tent. Uh, and again, same as the Alpha, it's got the two side windows, the rain fly, and uh, the moonroof. This does have the option, this, the Stealth comes with the uh, rain awnings over both windows. I personally like to keep those closed, so I have them closed at the moment. The big difference is the look and feel and the fact that you can carry some gear on top of your tent, which is super cool. So one major difference between all our other tent reviews and this truck is I'm currently 10 feet off the ground. So we actually did add a slightly longer ladder um, because this truck is ginormous, but for the average truck, the ladder that it comes with will be just fine. I think it's a 10 footer. This is a 12 footer. Uh, and that modification was actually pretty easy to make, which was super nice. Um, but from here on out, it's the same soft pad that you're used to in the Alpha all the same pockets inside, the same material, same fabric. Uh, it doesn't appear that they've made any other changes materially to the inside. Uh, purely the, the latching mechanisms and uh, the aluminum shell uh, for the outside, which is instrumental for us in the ability, again, to carry solar. So inside the tent, uh, they might have changed the color of this diamond back pattern. I can, I can, it's the exact same size as the Alpha, so probably six and a half feet long by, I don't know, maybe, oh, probably five, maybe close to six feet wide. So every bit of two adults and a kid, or two adults and a couple kids perhaps, uh, very much in love with this tent and we'll be using it for years to come. And I'm traveling around the US in this tent, so in another six months or so, hopefully I'll have weeks of sleeping in this tent and opening and closing it and I'll have a, a much more thorough review but for now very happy with it I'm glad we got the panels on the roof and super stoked to start traveling with the new stealth tent okay so there's our quick review of the new stealth tent by Tough Stuff Overland obviously the big thing the aluminum shell and for us the ability to get solar panels on the roof which is huge for us and a big game changer we're looking super forward to getting out on the trail and using it more this year putting it through its paces and potentially have a much more in-depth review in six months as we figure out what may go wrong with it. But so far, it's been great. Love the tent. And thank you, Tough Stuff, for coming out with an aluminum shell. And I think now is when I'm supposed to talk about comments, subscriptions, notifications, and all kinds of other things. But you know the program. Uh, and uh, thanks for watching. This is Brandon, Trailbenders Overland. Ciao. If you haven't yet, head over to our online store to check out the awesome gear we use and all the new merch. Link in the description below.